Hey guys, Moan Pobert here and today we're going to talk about how to have more energy. Let's get to it. So hey, if you're new to this channel, my name is Moan Pobert and I'm here to share and document my journey in basically more than 10 businesses over the last few years. I'm here to share and document what I've been through, things that worked for me, things that didn't work for me. And it's basically so you won't have the same learning curve that I had to go through. I'm here to show you that you don't have to also start businesses from scratch. You can just go and buy them. I don't think there's anything wrong with starting businesses from scratch. It's just that the chances of you getting them successful is very hard. That's why I suggest to people to go and buy existing businesses or grow their existing businesses by acquisition. So instead of just growing them internally by doing more sales and marketing, I suggest them to go and buy other businesses, to buy their competitors or other complementary businesses. So that's what this channel is all about. Like, subscribe, comment and hit the notification button so you won't miss new videos because I'm posting daily. So how do you have more energy? You know, people with energy, society might call them obsessed. They call them, hey, you're crazy, you're working too hard, you're too passionate, too excited. And the question is, is it good? Is it not good? Do you think that energy is good to be successful in business? Is it maybe the opposite? Maybe you need to be calm and chill and very thoughtful and logic and don't be all around the place with all the energy. So what's the right answer here? So to begin with, I think that it's really important to have energy. Otherwise, if you don't have energy to do your work, it's going to be really hard to go through the, the struggles and challenges of being an entrepreneur or business owner. In the end of the day, you're going to have lots of ups and downs. And unless you have energy to sustain those things, it's going to be really hard for you to move forward. Because I don't care who you are or what business you have or what business you're looking to buy, you're going to have ups and downs. This life is, is very challenging. And unless you're expecting that, it's going to be really hard and unless you're having the right energy it's going to be really hard to go through the struggles. I also think that energy is really important because unless you have energy you won't have the certainty to take action and the most important thing when you're taking action in a business is to have a certainty behind your actions. It's many times they say that it's more about you being certain about taking the action then so it doesn't matter if you what action you take it's more about you being certain about taking that action if that makes sense and unless you have energy and really good state and and i guess really like kind of like a, a sure yeah just certainty behind you it's going to be really hard to go through and, and take those next difficult actions in your business so how do you have more energy what works for me at least is combine few things like basically taking care of what I'm eating, taking care of working out, and also the mental side of things. So for me, something that really works for me is meditation. And it's not, I think you need to really differentiate between energy like all over the place, between like a very calm, certain energy, you know what I mean? And that's what meditation has really helped me with. It's just given me the certainty to move on and make things with this calm, one thought side things instead of, when I'm not meditating, I have too many thoughts. I'm just thinking my mind is all over the place. And when I meditate at least once, twice, sometimes even three times a day, if I have a lot of things going on, and when I'm saying meditating, even if it's sitting for like 10 minutes, and there are tons of meditations options, I'm not, I'm not this meditation expert. What really worked for me lately is working through Joe Dispenza work, which is amazing and working amazingly well for me. But whatever meditation works for you will work. I think it's about sitting down and really getting to a point where your mind is only is not all over the place and just thinking on one thing. And then when you're looking at your to-do list, you're able to really focus on that thing and actually execute on those actions instead of making your mind thinking all over the place and forgetting what you need to do. Then it's about working out. When you move your body, your, your body, I mean, your body is everything, right? When you move your body, you change your state, you want to have a different energy. So always sit with certainty, have a power position and go and work out and everyone got their own workouts and whatever works for them. And then it's about, in my opinion, making sure that you have a purpose behind your actions. So whatever you want to do with your day, let's say you have a few things you want to accomplish today. So write them down, but then think with yourself, why are those things important to you? Why do you want to accomplish them? And when you have the purpose and why behind your actions, that's going to give you a very uh, intense energy to go out there and have the reason to accomplish those activities, if that makes sense. And after we have all those fundamentals, so taking care of your health, whatever you eat, working out, have the, uh, I guess, 
make it silly like meditating or having a very good energy in your head for me it's also about like i said having a purpose behind my words and then i think it's really important to have accountability there's nothing that gives me energy and a purpose to accomplish things like accountability and i mentioned that in the past videos to like literally burn notes of money if you're not accomplishing the task that you promised yourself that you will and trust me you're gonna burn 100 dollar on every task that you didn't accomplish and you'll eventually do those tasks trust me there's only so many notes of 100 dollars you want to burn every day because you didn't accomplish a task that you set yourself in advance that you want to accomplish and confidence in the end of the day and certainty and energy comes from you literally being honest with yourself and I guess saying that you're going to do something and actually doing that then you're going to have more certainty more confidence and you're going to build the momentum for your own benefits and I don't care what everyone else is telling you maybe in the past in the 70s and 80s it was cool to to drink a lot of whiskey every day and do your work and still be really successful nowadays I think it's going to be really hard for you to compete unless you have a very uh, good clean energy and your purpose i really believe that moving forward those who are going to be really successful in this world are people who have a very good reason to do those actions so it's going to be helping others and contributing and doing things behind just their selfish reasons and all those things when they're combined that's how they can go out there have the energy to get the results that you want and yeah be, be successful so let me know what you think guys let me know in the comments below what really works for you to have more energy in the day for me it's mostly about the things that i mentioned here today so it's all about taking care of your health taking care of your body taking care of your mental mind and having a purpose and accountability behind whatever you want to do those things when combined will give you a lot of energy obviously we can get into the details and the exact diet and supplements maybe you need to take and what's the exact workout that you want to have in order to have more energy but in the end of the day, i think it's really personal and everyone have their own different ways and reasons and and things that really work for them so just pick whatever works for you or just try many different things and i'll just add an extra bonus and say in the end of the day really it all comes down to being grateful and have the gratitude of whatever you already have in life so whatever energy you have if that energy comes from um needing to achieve something because you feel like you lack something already right now um, i think that's the wrong energy to have but when you're coming from a place of gratitude and your energy and actions are coming from a place of giving and contributing um, that's going to produce completely different results and that's what i suggest to you so that's it for today guys i hope you enjoyed it see the links in the description below if you want to get in touch or just go to moanpober.com forward slash quiz and there are all the options to work with us there it's again mostly about business but I'm, i want to expand the channel a little bit more and just talk about whatever i feel like so i hope you enjoyed it and let me know in the comments below what you think hit the notification button if you didn't yet and i'll see you soon